I respect that parking. That looks good. Okay. Home from that class seat in a granola bar. That was uh, media power culture talking about how media and publishing and the records industry has changed. That's why the Andrews sisters and Frank Sinatra and Sammy Davis and Dean Martin were brought in today, which was kind of cool. Um, it's two minutes of five. I think Kenan's coming over. We're going to replace that BMW Roundel on the trunk lid, which desperately needs to be done. Uh, he ordered that from ECS and it arrived. I think he got fog bulbs too. I don't know if those are going in or not. But he'll be here soon. And let the weekend begin. Thank God. It's a balmy 17 outside. As you can see, we got more snow overnight. It's been snowing all day, except for now. Um, roads have dried out a little bit, but there's tons of salt everywhere. It's nasty. Halo's on like a boss. Looks like he's gonna back it in. Friggin' rates. It looks smaller than mine because it's lower for some reason. I haven't really figured that out yet. There's more height in between the top of the wheel and the bottom of the fender, but everything else, I mean, it is the sport suspension on the car. I guess it's maybe smaller wheels. I don't know. Well, that was definitely polished too much, wouldn't you say? <laughs> yeah, a little bit. Yeah. This one looks a lot nicer. Yeah. Probably the exact same part number as is your... this one I has. Yeah, probably. I don't, I think mine came from ECS. Yes, that's where that came from. Uh-huh. And two grommets. And stuck. It's a fun job. Oh, it's coming. Yeah, it's coming. Give it shit. Could just leave it like that. It kind of blend, blends in. It got some holes in there, though. That's about a four-beer job. Yeah. yeah. Much, much better. All right, guys. It's 2.52 in the morning on day 802. We're going to wrap this up. Kenan left a long time ago. I haven't filmed anything since. I talked to Bobby on Skype for a while. I wrote an article for the site, actually. It's a really good one um, in terms of, you know, when I got the M5, I was doing all this research. And by the way, that's why E39's race came about. So I'm doing all this research for the car. I'm not finding anything. There's really nothing um, incredibly well documented. So I thought, you know what? These documents and resources that I'm looking for don't exist. How about I create them? So I be the guinea pig and create all this stuff and now we get to wait for the Mac to connect and finally load the site and get to the article that I spent about two and a half hours writing. We got a beautiful featured image there. If we click the actual post title and come into the article, it is uh, relatively lengthy but goes over the entire process of goes over the entire process of uh, doing the pre facelift head and tail lights to the post facelift head and tail lights, which uh, was a significant upgrade on not only my car, but any pre-facelift E39. That's just a huge change. So I encourage you to check that out if you would like to see some pictures and read a little bit of insight. Um, but that's it for today. We got the badge on the 525, the 525 and the I badge is coming later, so we'll, we'll do that later. But it's going to be work in progress, just like all of these cars are. So that is it for Thursday. We'll see what tomorrow brings, Friday, 803. Talk to you then. Good night.